Hello. Hello, judges and everybody. And what is your name, please? My name is Nini. Hello, Nini. <laughs> In the latest season of America's Got Talent, a remarkable performance has taken the internet by storm. It was a musical act by Nini. Nini is a distinguished musician from Taiwan who has spent over two decades mastering and performing traditional Chinese folk instruments. Her unique blend of traditional Asian instruments with modern genres has intrigued many, leading audiences to delve deeper into her background and cultural influences. This newfound curiosity has brought greater attention to her music and the rich traditions she represents, with many eager to learn more about the story behind her innovative sounds. Join us as we tell you what America's Got Talent didn't tell you about Nini. Nini grew up in a small town in the Taiwanese countryside in a regular Taiwanese family. Her mother ran a modest clothing store on the bottom floor of their house, while her father operated a tire shop out of their garage. Despite the challenges, they worked hard to support her music education, enabling her to attend an eight-year music conservatory and university program. Her journey into music began with her grandfather, who would visit on weekends with his handmade erhu, a traditional Chinese folk instrument similar to a violin. He played old folk songs and sang to the family, which sparked her interest in music. Inspired by him, her grandfather crafted her first sanxian, a three-stringed folk instrument, so they could play together. Nini was about six years old at the time, and from that moment on, her passion for music has continued to grow. Nini plays eight different instruments, showcasing her versatility and deep musical talent. Her core instruments include the Ruan, a Chinese guitar, the Sanxian, a three-stringed instrument that is the predecessor of the Japanese shamisen, and the Li Qin, a small Chinese lute. Additionally, she plays the piper, erhu, Irish banjo, and ukulele. Most recently, she's introduced her new Kickstarter-funded creation, the Dao Yu. Nina collaborated with master craftsmen at Blackworm Instruments to design and create a groundbreaking new instrument that harmonizes the sounds of the East and West. This innovative instrument, named the Dao Yu, which translates to Jade Sword in Chinese, blends modern sound with ancient tradition. The Dao Yu combines elements of a traditional Chinese folk instrument with the characteristics of a heavy metal shredding machine, drawing inspiration from ancient Chinese culture, folk music, and traditions. Its design is modeled after Guan Yu's dragon blade and colored to resemble his jade cloak. For Nini, this instrument is a meaningful way to preserve her cultural heritage and Taoist stories. After this innovation, Nini wasted no time and went on AGT to show the world her musical genius. Nini auditioned for season 19 by playing three traditional Chinese instruments. She began with a soothing tune that intrigued both the judges and the audience. She then transitioned to a more upbeat piece on a second instrument. Initially, the judges seemed unsure about her performance. However, when Nini switched to her third instrument, which resembled an electric guitar, she delivered an electrifying rendition of Flight of the Bumblebee, leaving everyone in awe. The audience went wild, and Nini received a standing ovation, bringing her to tears. Sofia Vergara praised the uniqueness of her performance, calling it spectacular and unexpected. Heidi Klum found Nini's playing mesmerizing and incredibly fast. Howie Mandel appreciated her originality and remarked that such auditions are why he loves being a part of the show. Simon Cowell expressed his admiration by stating that anyone would be mad not to want her on tour, and he considered her audition one of his favorites in a long time. Nini received a unanimous yes from the judges, securing her spot in season 19 of America's Got Talent. The audience eagerly awaits her next performance. While many viewers were awestruck by Nini's performance on America's Got Talent, some expressed concerns about the audience's reaction. Critics noted that the appreciation for Nini's talent seemed to increase significantly only when she transitioned to a more Western sound. During her traditional music segment, many in the auditorium appeared disoriented and less engaged, only showing enthusiasm once she picked up the guitar and began playing a familiar Western-style piece. These comments shed light on a broader issue, a perceived lack of recognition for Nini's traditional and cultural music. 
Some netizens felt that Nini's efforts to showcase her cultural heritage should have been valued more and that the audience's shift in appreciation towards the Western elements overshadowed her representation of traditional music. They expressed a hope that in her future performances, Nini would remain more true to her roots and continue to represent her cultural background with the respect and admiration it deserves. Nini's journey to success on America's Got Talent is a powerful story of resilience and determination. Despite her exceptional talent, Nini faced a significant hurdle in 2021 when she first auditioned for the show. She submitted a virtual audition, pouring her heart into a performance with the hope of securing an invitation for an in-person audition. Despite showcasing her unique blend of traditional Chinese folk music and modern elements, Nini didn't make it past the first round and was not featured that season. Many might have been discouraged by such a setback, but not Nini. She refused to let this disappointment define her. Instead, she took it as a challenge and an opportunity to refine her craft further. Over the next few years, she continued to hone her skills, pushing the boundaries of her musical abilities and blending her deep knowledge of Chinese traditional instruments with contemporary sounds. When Nini decided to audition again, she came back stronger and more determined than ever. Her latest performance on AGT was a mesmerizing display of her musical prowess, captivating both the judges and the audience. This time, she didn't just audition, she made a statement. Nini's most successful music video to date is a cover song of Long Ma, a track inspired by the mythical creature known as the Dragon Horse in Chinese mythology. Long Ma, which translates to Dragon Horse, is a legendary winged horse adorned with dragon scales. The video has mesmerized audiences, amassing over 5 million views and showcasing Nini's unique ability to blend traditional Asian elements with modern music styles. Given the success and enchantment surrounding this magical piece, fans are eagerly hoping to see Nini perform Long Ma in the upcoming rounds of America's Got Talent, should she advance further in the competition. The performance of this iconic track would not only highlight her exceptional talent, but also introduce a broader audience to the rich cultural heritage embedded in her music. A few years ago, Nini was deeply immersed in the world of live streaming, regularly broadcasting on both Twitch and Reddit. Her dedication to this medium earned her a frequent spot on Reddit's top-watching posts, showcasing her popularity and engagement. She maintained a consistent online presence by regularly interacting with her fans and delivering a steady stream of content across multiple platforms. This approach not only kept her audience engaged, but also provided opportunities to promote and sell her merchandise effectively. Her commitment to live streaming allowed her to build a strong digital community, while also generating additional revenue through online sales. At the beginning of 2024, Nini embarked on a new chapter by launching her band, Nini. The band's debut has been met with critical acclaim, with their first three singles earning widespread recognition and accumulating millions of views and streams. Nini's success has led to a series of exciting performances. With a robust online presence of over 147,000 followers and 18 million views on her engaging videos, Nini has established a formidable digital footprint. Her electrifying live performances across the USA, Europe, and Asia consistently entertain audiences, while her discography, which fuses metal riffs with Asian melodies, highlights her artistic versatility and global appeal. Nini's innovative approach to storytelling through music offers listeners a groundbreaking journey where tradition and modernity seamlessly converge. As Nini continues to make waves in the music industry, fans can look forward to more amazing performances and new music from this trailblazing artist.